I'm very excited about being on this segment this morning. It is one of New York Times and People's most anticipated books taking place in the Big Apple. Jasmine Yang comes from a rural Chinese village without any money or family support, while Rebecca Whitney comes from a beautiful home and a high-powered career. Follow along with these two unforgettable women in The Leftover Woman. And joining us today is the author herself, Jean Kwok, along with our good friend Robin Call from Reading with Robin. Good morning, ladies. Hey, good morning. It's so wonderful to be here. It is so wonderful to have you. I was telling Jean that, you know, I was reading all about you last night. I was so excited to actually meet you in person. For anybody out there, any of our viewers that haven't read or heard about The Leftover Woman yet, give them a little bit about the plot, a little summary of the book. Well, it is about two women two worlds and one impossible choice. Mm -hmm. So The Leftover Woman is about what happens when a young woman named Jasmine in China has a baby and it's told shortly afterwards that her daughter had died. But she finds out a few years later that her daughter had not died but had been given away for adoption by her no good husband to a wealthy... <laughs> That's my favorite part. <laughs> and how she said it to her. No, no, to her, to a wealthy... <laughs> American couple. Okay. And when the novel opens, Jasmine has followed her daughter to New York City to get her back. Okay, and it is. It's an unbelievable book. Very excited to dive into it. And let me, you know, Robin, we were talking before this. So many events that you put on are so amazing. Told you this morning, I saw everybody talking about the event last so night. It's so cool. It was hard to go to sleep. We were I, like, we need to post, we need to share. Yeah, tell me about the okay. book. Tell me about the event last night, the energy that you bring together for Jean. What was it like last night? The energy was just, it's, it's one of those things where you just know that people are so happy to be there. They're readers, they're, they're seeing their friends. You know, yeah. it's Rhode Island, people are always running into each other. And it's a compassionate group. And, you know, through reading, we gain empathy. And that was really evident last night. And it was lighthearted because all of my friends are fun. Yes. Jean had me ballroom dancing. So, Stop it. Yeah. I and did. You had to be there. You had to be there. No, I love that. I did. And it's true. I believe that books are so important, like The Leftover yeah. Woman. We love that you guys have us on the show because, you know, they bring people together. You mm -hmm. know, it's, a, it's about unity and creating a community. And in this book in particular, Tell me what you want your readers to leave with. Well, you know, The Leftover Woman is, of course, told by both Jasmine, the birth mother, and Rebecca, this high-powered career woman, um, the adoptive mother, and there's one child, and who's the child going to go to? But it is a book of unity. It's yeah. a book about how much we as women are not seen by our society and how much we have in common, mm -hmm. how much they love this child, not about the issues that divide us. I love that. Now, I know you guys are very busy. So, Robin, what do you have coming up? I know you're going to so, be Yeah, Jean and I will be, thank you for asking. Tonight we'll be at the Lenox Hotel discussing The Leftover Woman. So very excited about that. Saturday is Boston Book Festival. Jean and I are not on the same panel for that one, but I have to share her. <laughs> and we're headed to Iceland for the, the uh, book festival for Iceland Noir in November. That's so, unbelievable. Yeah. Very, very busy. Very, very, very bookish, busy out bookishly there. Bookishly busy. I love, so I love that. Yeah. And Jean, can you give us a little insight on what you're working on now, what's coming up next for you? Well, I have a really big tour for the leftover women right now. So heading indeed through the US and then, you know, Hawaii, Iceland, Canada, the UK. But I am working on a new New book. I'll give you guys a sneak peek, and it is a murder set at Harvard. Ooh. Ooh. Uh oh, we missed that last night. Mm. I love that. Okay, so that's a Ooh. little niblet out there for all to chew on. Very yeah. cool. Well, thank you both so much. It was unbelievable meeting you, Robin. Love oh, you to thank pieces. You. Thank, thank you. Thank you for Audrey. being here, talking about the Leftover Woman. And you can find where you can buy the Leftover Woman. You can also get it on Kindle. We have everything listed right over on our website, Roadshow.com.